second group ATLS MCQ which of the following is addressed in the secondary survey for arm fracture can be addressed in the secondary survey number two young male fallen from height with obvious flail chest fall from height with flail chest ABG showing pH 7.47 alkalotic uh, what is the cause of abnormality in ABG in flail chest if a pulmonary contusion causes ABG abnormalities Number three, Cushing triad, which occur in case of increased intracranial pressure. Cushing triad. Hmm? Bradycardia, irregular respiration, and increase in systolic blood pressure. In the Cushing triad, in case of increased intracranial pressure, they feel Cushing triad, increase intracranial pressure. If I increase in systolic blood pressure and the bradycardia and the irregular respiration. For trauma in pregnant woman with clear fluid leakage from the vagina is an indication for hospitalization. Is an indication for hospitalization. Five blood at the external meatus. What you will do? Retrograde urethrogram. Retrograde urethrogram. Six. Scenario of pelvic fracture. Pelvic fracture. Vertical shear force. Vertical shear force. With posterior sacrospinous ligament disruption. Vertical shear force. Force with posterior sacrospinous ligament disruption. Seven twelve year old boy sustained blunt abdominal trauma while playing football. Fast scan is positive. Hemodynamically stable. What to do next? CT up in a child, 12 year, fast positive, hemodynamically stable, next CT up. Eight old patient had multiple rib fracture. Multiple rib fracture. And splinting of the right chest. What to do? Analgesic. Multiple rib fracture, splinting of the chest, even analgesia. Memorize indication for burn transfer. For example, mixed, partial, and full sickness burn, more than 10%. Hmm? Indication of burn transfer, for example, mixed. <coughs> partial and full sickness burn more than 10 percent number 10 in comparison with young adult elderly patient exhibit which of the following regarding brain injury <coughs> less mobility with regular Acceleration, deceleration, no. Well, less stretching of bridging vein. Less stretching of the bridging vein than younger adult. Bridging vein are more fragile in elderly than young. The bridging vein hmm, are more fragile in elderly than young adult. Number 11, 
which of the following will be missed by DBL? Missed by BDBL? Subcapsular hematoma of the spleen can be missed in DPL. 12. Which of the following tests will evaluate the retroperitoneum? Retroperitoneum can be evaluated by CT. 13. Patient tried to commit suicide with rope, hyperextension of the neck. When he presented to the ER, he had hoarseness of voice and crepitation in the neck. What to do? Needle cricocyrodotomy. And he came with hoarseness of voice and crepitation in the neck. Needle cricocyrodotomy. Then after that, you can do a direct laryngoscope and the intubation. 14. Burn victim with signs of inhalation injury. Carponious material and singed eyebrow. Inhalation injury will do intubation. 15. Burn victim has circumferential burn. Circumferential burn. Core temperature is 34. What next is carotomy? The circumferential burn is carotomy. A, B, C. Circumferential burn in the breathing. So you will do escarotomy. Number 16. Which of the following is normal in the third trimester of pregnancy? Third trimester of pregnancy, widened symphysis pubis. Increase the residual lung volume, this falls. Decrease the plasma volume, falls. Decrease the total RPC mass, falls. If a third trimester of pregnancy, there is widened symphysis pubis. 17. Trauma patient was hypotensive. Then give him one liter of crystalloid. Now he is alert and talking. Which of the following statement is correct? Correct. Answer, he has good cerebral blood flow. If the patient is alert and talking, means good cerebral blood flow. 18. Which of the following is contraindication for nasal intubation? Contraindication for nasal intubation is Lefort 3 fracture. Because Lefort 3 fracture, there is cerebriform plate fracture.